So, John, this is uh, the teaser trailer for Disney's Snow White. This comes out on the 21st of March next year. Um, so we're getting a glimpse of what has or what is to come uh, for this live action retelling of the classic animated story from, I don't know, the 1930s and 1940s. Not really sure. I think it was one long, of the first ones, wasn't it? Yes, some people would say when we was fab. <laughs> yeah. I would disagree with that sentiment. Barbiturate bar, bar, soap, is that what the name of the soap was that they were using back in the day? You know what I'm mm, talking about? Not sure. Honking of that soap. Carbolic. Carbolic soap, yeah. maybe not barbiturate. Bar, I think that may be <laughs> quite bad for you. But just, <laughs> I don't it, think carbolic was yeah, good for you. Yeah, it wasn't fucking good. There was nothing fab back then, apart from <laughs> guitars. Forget about it. It was shit. You're kidding yourself on. It's nostalgia. It's much better now, believe me. But yes, yeah, Stephen, also a lot of controversy. I think it's Rachel Ziegler as the name of the leading actress. She's been cast. Yes. Some people believe she's not white enough <laughs> to play Snow White. I'm of the opinion that that is irrelevant. Yeah. As long as she's the outstanding candidate in terms of an actor, that's all that matters. Yep. Um, it's a story. It can be modernised. These are old stories from a bygone era when the human race sadly was in a darker and more ignorant time. And mind fit set. Some might so, say a lot of people haven't moved on. <laughs> oh, some definitely haven't moved on. Uh, yeah. Thankfully, we have though. And yeah. uh, ultimately, I just want to see a retelling. I've really enjoyed the Disney live action remakes, every single one. Yeah. Beauty and the Beast, yeah. The Lion King, Aladdin, Dumbo. I've enjoyed them a hell of a lot, man. I've Especially went to see the them all in the theaters. On these retellings, um, because we, we've known for, or we've known a, a version of these stories for yeah. decades. Decades and decades upon decades, and when they do the live action, it's got a lot to live up to. And, and in the I, case I of think, the Lion King, I, I grew up with them it. Have. Yeah, the Lion King. Yeah. So it was very prominent in my mind as yeah. a kid. So that's always the version. But I could still go to a theater opening day, opening weekend, whatever it was, and watch the the live action remake and get something from yeah. it. It's a different story. And if you don't like it, you've got the originals. Yeah. You can go and watch it. So uh, Gal Gadot yeah. as well was on this. Gal Gadot, yeah. yeah. I'm interested to see how she performs in this. On her day, she's a great actor. Yeah. Seems to go up a level when she has Chris Pine next to her. He's not here this time, so it'll be intriguing to see what she's like. A lot of controversy over the, the dwarfs as well, Steve, and I think they're CGI or something. Okay. They're not actual actors. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah. But, uh, I don't mind that. I don't care. Yeah. Really, to be honest with you. Shall we press play and yeah. get into it? Yeah, let's we do it. We may hate it, by the way. Yeah, I'm not going to... And what is it? Glaze it? Yeah. I'll tell you the truth if I think it looks shit I'll tell you it looks shit play fireflies Yeah. Visually, it looks yeah. really impressive. Um, don't mind the look of the cast at all. I'd quite like the aesthetic of yeah. having CGI dwarfs in there. Looks like it's going to be a a fitting, a retelling, modernised retelling of a classic story. Yeah, um, it looks better than that other weird right wing shit that got released last year. What was that? Oh, it was some random right wing. White version. It was just dreadful. Oh, yeah. Didn't I even think it's been released. That. It was a trailer. It was oh, dropped. Right, okay. When they were backlashing against us, you know, the usual push. Uh, but Stephen, I think it looks all right, man. It yeah. may turn out to be utter shite because it is a trailer and it's they're going to show you the good yeah. bits. It yeah. may be rubbish, 
when you go and watch the actual film, it may be sacrilege, it may be changing things for the yeah. worse. Like I say, I'm not here to glaze Disney or this film, and in the main, I've liked the remakes. I like what I'm seeing here, early doors, but... Technically, I technical. like what I see, yeah. John. Uh, it's hard to do when it's a teaser. They're not giving too much away. I think we all know the story anyway. It's not like they're going to give too much mm. away, unless there's any twists. I doubt it very much, but it all, it all, it all depends on performances for me. Um, casting... I, you just got to trust the studio that they've, they've got the right actors in place. I don't really know too much about um, Rachel Seager. Seager. I yeah. don't really know too much about her, to be honest with you. But She's half Polish. I will. I will judge it when I see it. I will watch this as well. Um, I've seen the animated one time and time again throughout my life. Yeah. So I'm very interested to see. But on a technical level, John, it looks really good. And as you mentioned, I like that filter as well. It gave yeah. it a nice sort of unique, authentic look. Um, I got and, that from the first image yeah. released. I'm like, that's kind of weird aesthetic. What they're it's, doing with it's, it's like that kind of Wizard of Oz effect. Yeah, it's on it. It's a like kind of colouring they've put it through it. You know, but technical. Um, yeah, yeah. But I like the look of it, and I like that song as well. <laughs> that whistling yeah. song. Quite yeah. earworm and Justin. Yeah. Whistle, What's your thoughts on Magic work? Mirror on the Wall? Though that's the main takeaway from me. Um, when I grew up, I could swear it was Mirror Mirror on the Wall. It was mm. the fairest of them all. Magic mirror on the wall. And that's one of those Mandela effect moments again where you've got the Berenstein Bears. Did Mandela die in, in jail in uh, South Africa? No, he didn't. Because he came to Glasgow after he got released. And that's very much a universe I was alive and kicking in. I'm pretty sure I was alive <laughs> at that point. Early 90s. Yeah. Yeah, he was here. But there's a lot of Mandela effects. The Fruit of Loom logo. I'm sure it had a sort of basket as well back in the day. It did. It did have a basket. <laughs> I don't know. No, it doesn't. Uh, so there's lots of little things. Yeah. What's your thoughts on that? Magic Mirror on the Wall. I'd love to hear you taking that. Did you grow up with Mirror Mirror or Magic Mirror? What's your thoughts on the trailer on the casting of Rachel Ziegler? If you can keep it sort of above board and not be a racist scumbag, that'd be wonderful. If you want to do that, show yourself in your own true light then. Yeah. It's a reflection on you. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, share your thoughts on our reaction mirror, as well. Mirror reflection. Good one, John. Yeah. Put comments down below. Like the video if you've enjoyed it. Subscribe to the channel, hit the bell icon to get notifications straight to one's eyes for future content like this. And until the next time, thank you for watching us.